It's present day Sophie here, just checking in quickly before the vlog starts. I know it's been a little while since I've posted a video, but that's why I have all this good content for you now. I have all this excellent vlog content that I'm gonna get you guys all caught up on. So some of the clips are a little bit older, but I thought I'd throw them in anyway. I just might not put what the date is on them, you know what I mean? Uh, but I really want to include them just so you guys could be caught up on everything, like I said. That's all I have to say for now, so. Enjoy. So I have a couple of packages and I thought I'd start this, uh, this day by showing you what I got. We have Motel Rocks. I'm sure you guys have seen my video about trying to find perfect baggy jeans. So I thought I would try their baggy jeans. And I also ordered a pair of pants. So these are the parallel jeans. I got a size small and a size medium. These are the same style of jeans. The same color what <laughs> like you, that's not right so this is the medium parallel jean the waist is definitely too big but i quite like the fit of the leg so i might try on the small and see if the waist fits a bit better same style of jeans but in the size small if i didn't mention this they're both in the 33 leg the, the waist is great So here are the size small jeans again with an outfit. My main issue is that I think the zipper is too short and when the zipper is too short, there's like this weird kind of like unoccupied dead zone like between like the zipper and the crutch and it can be really unflattering. It makes me look very square. This is just like a big square here. And then that combined with like the sort of the empty space with like the no zipper zone, <laughs> it's like, I'm sure you guys can tell what I mean. And next are these pants. I got these in a medium and I think there's just a little bit too much excess fabric in the crotch area. And uh, it also fits kind of weird around the waist. It's like high at the front, but kind of too low at the back. So I don't know. What is going on here? So it is Saturday. It's a bit after 10 a.m. I'm going to check out a couple of op shops <laughs> slash, slash thrift stores. Do I need to keep saying thrift store? Thrift? Thrift stores is so difficult to say thrift shops. Thrift to shops. It's like op shop, op shop, op shops, the Australian term. So much easier to say. I'm sure like other countries use that term as well. But anyway, I'm going to check out some op shops today. I feel like I just do the same kinds of things in my vlog all the time. <laughs> No chicken sandy. These are so good. And they also do like a tofu scramble one that tastes uh, very eggy. They have the right seasoning. It's really good as well. Uh, but I haven't had this one in a while, so I thought I'd uh, get this one. And I also got a sugar free V for a little bit of energy for the next stop. tried on a whole bunch of jeans and they were all terrible <laughs> so now I'm moving on to some trousers I'm just not sure about all these pleats like if they don't have the pleats I prefer them <laughs>
before I head out today, I wanted to show you guys my fake freckles. I just use Freck. This is a pretty popular one, pretty well-known one. This is only my third or fourth time applying fake freckles, but hopefully it's not too bad. So um, uh, don't judge. <laughs> don't be too harsh on me if they don't look perfect or super realistic. I have like uh, a lot of moles and freckles over my whole body and I have quite a few moles and freckles on my face, but they're quite small and then I have like a few on my cheeks here but I don't I've never had like tons and tons and tons of freckles so I just apply them all over my cheeks and nose mostly concentrated on my nose I give them a few seconds to dry and kind of stain my skin and then I use my finger to gently tap over those ones I've just placed and I use my finger as a stamp and just stamp more freckles all over and I just repeat that process until I'm happy with it so that's how I apply fake freckles I've been really into it the past couple of months and I also apply bronzer uh, over the top a little bit on my forehead as well and just gives a really nice uh, summery look you know I know some people just use uh, eyeliner or like a pencil or something but I really like this because it doesn't smudge it actually creates little stains in fact it will stain your finger a little bit <laughs> I think I have like a tiny little bit of staining it's mostly come off my outfit for today I've got this white crop t-shirt and then my thrifted blue check shirt super cute I love the size it's just perfect and I love the length and then I've just got my soupy ripped jeans anyway I'm just gonna wear white sneakers with this pretty standard look <laughs> So at Darling Square today, sorry if it's a bit windy, I'm gonna grab some lunch. I got a cinnamon dolce latte on oat milk, which is exciting because they don't always have the cinnamon dolce syrup and one of the vegan orange and poppy seed muffins, which is so good if you guys are in Australia, highly recommend. So I have a lash update for you guys. I talked about this in my holiday gift guide for 2020. It's the Lush Growth Serum by Silly George and I'll put the before and afters again. This was also in my gift guide. Okay, please excuse me. I'm still in my pajamas. I'm just putting my makeup on for the day, but I want to get a shot of how my lashes look with mascara. I'm like, I can't believe how much longer my lashes are. Like they're just, they keep like they're touching my eyebrows now. Like I, I have to do my eyebrows before my lashes because otherwise my lashes get in the way. And I have a giveaway for you guys. You will get a lash serum, the Heart Eyes Mascara, which is a tubing mascara. If you guys know me, tubing mascara is the only kind that I wear. And this one has a dual wand, I think volumizing and then lengthening is that one. And then you also get the Lid and Lash Cleanser, little makeup bag and uh, the headband. So obviously yours will come all sealed and packaged, you know, like this, for example, mine's open because I've been using it. There'll be a link in the description to enter. This isn't even paid for by Silly George. Like I'm not being sponsored to talk about this. I ordered this months ago, just using my personal you know info and somehow they managed to link it up like they they found out that I, I don't know how they did it they found out I had an online presence and were like oh hey do you want to do a giveaway <laughs> which I thought was so funny and also if you want to go ahead and buy any of these things if you don't want to wait um, I will have a discount code for you guys as well it will be here on the screen and it will be linked below so you can go check that out We just arrived here at Nutty. <laughs> I always, uh, I've been pronouncing it as Nutty, but it's actually Nutty. We're just uh, checking in. This is a very, um, I don't know, like Australian thing. You have to check in using a QR codes. All checked in so they can track us if they need to. You guys can have a look at that. I don't know if any other countries have this system in place. Like I'm sure New Zealand does. I imagine, I don't know if New Zealand do because there's like no COVID there, but do comment below if your country has a system like this.
it is Sunday. I'm going out for lunch and to the Australian Museum because they renovated and since they reopened, they have free admission for like limited time only. I'm going with my friend Vanessa and we're going to Bodhi for lunch. You guys know, like if you've been watching my channel for a while, you know how much I freaking love Bodhi. It's like one of my favorite all vegan restaurants of all time. It is so good. It's uh, like vegan yamcha. Oh my God, I'm so excited. For my outfit today, please excuse my mirror, by the way. It still has the cardboard frame on it because of reasons. I like want to 3D print some corners for it. Anyway, it's a long story. We've got my rings, Swarovski necklace, my <laughs> Jeremy Scott Adidas t-shirt, which I have two of these guys, just keep in mind. And then these pants that I thrifted recently and I'm also gonna be wearing my white sneakers. And I think I might bring my crossbody bag. I also did my hair in these little pigtails, like but very high and kind of like close together ones. Uh, yeah, cause it's a really hot day and I need to wash my hair. So I thought I would tie it back. <laughs> We're here at Bodhi. It's a beautiful, warm day. I'm here with Vanessa. Say hi, Vanessa. Hi. And so far we've got barbecue pork buns, these prawn things, the barbecue squares, and these are pumpkin, and they look like little pumpkins as well. So now we're gonna start eating, but we're definitely gonna get more, and I'm excited for desserts. I hope they have those little donuts today, because they're really good. I'll talk about our desserts. We have these, they're just called the chocolate balls. I don't really know exactly what they are because I never had them. And then the passion fruit donuts, which are amazing. And Vanessa hasn't had them yet, so I'm very excited for her to try them. <laughs> another quick mention from future Sophie I live in New South Wales Australia and here in my state we had some like changes with mask wearing laws during the months that I filmed this video so if it seems inconsistent that's why but as I'm filming this now this little clip like nowhere requires masks pretty much because our cases are so low so um yeah just keep that in mind <laughs> coffee break. I just got a weak oat latte. Vanessa got her classic soy cap. Delicious. I actually really like this coffee, the little marionette coffee. They make really good coffee in my experience. It's always really tasty. If you live in Australia or like Sydney, I don't know how many places have it, but it's really tasty. dig in. Wow, looks so nice. So big. Oh, we have a nice view. Wow, waterfront. Cool. We just checked in. I'm sharing a room with my brother. That's my bed. You can just play stuff if you want, by the way. It's fine if there's noise, as long as it's not like copyright music. <laughs> Here we have a little welcome note. This is what I'm excited about. This is so cute. Takashi Murakami Perrier. Look how cute that is. And here is our view. I think I might 
film this again tomorrow when there's sun and it will look a lot nicer. OOTD, OOTN. This is really not working. This is my outfit for dinner. <laughs> I haven't figured out where I'm going to be able to like take video of my outfits. <laughs> oh, bless me. We're walking to dinner. It's actually raining a little bit. Look how pretty. Here we are for dinner. Size t shirt and shorts. It's a beautiful morning. I think we might be going to the beach today, the pool, and yeah, I'll see you guys at breakfast. Let's see, Flynn just got a nice new rashy. Let's see. Oh wow, super cool. Yeah, that's definitely my favorite design. And he got 30% off because they had some like email sign up thing. Now we're heading back to the hotel to get ready to go to the beach because it's a nice sunny warm day. I'm beach ready. Got my favorite Roxy rash vest. Love this. So great because I'm just so lazy I can't be bothered to put sunscreen over my body and this Australian sun you, you guys know the drill it's way stronger here and then I've got my shorts on but I also have like my regular bikini bottoms underneath I've got lots of sunscreen on and just like a little bit of makeup and brows of course this is my dip brow pom pomade because it stays on really well even in the water I put I've got my waterproof phone case so I did test it and it works, but I guess this will be the real test. Okay, so far so good. Ah, oh, this is so nice. Oh, big wave, kind of. Look, we go. So we are back from the beach. I reapplied some sunscreen, it's touched up a bit. I wanted to show you guys my waterproof phone case. I got this on Amazon, I'll link it below. I chose a really bright color just so, you know, it's like easy to see, really good quality, took really nice photos and video. You guys will see, it worked really well. I'm super happy with this. You do have to remove your phone case though, so it fits nice and snug, but I didn't find that the plastic interfered too much with the quality of the photos and video. I'm sure some of them won't turn out perfect. I put it around my neck and then I just tuck it under my rash vest or you can just kind of keep it dangling there if you prefer. It doesn't float though, just something worth keeping in mind. But yeah, I highly recommend. Like I said, I will link it below. I've arrived. We're here at our lunch spot. Here we go, Dog Shack. Little hot dog. That's so cute. Glenn and I just got Boost. So, oh, this is really dark. I got one of their new vegan ones. It's like the mango and passion fruit or something. Then got the mango tango crush, right? Mango tango crush. That's, I, that's a classic one. I used to have that back in the day. Now we're going to try and find the uh, albino bush turkey again. Is 
So I am currently in my robe, nice and cozy. Or do you guys like my nails? Oh, friends. Look how beautiful, just look how pretty that is. We just had a delicious dinner. We got Montezumas and I had the, okay, I'm gonna insert a picture here because I forgot to video it, but I had the vegan enchiladas. And now we're going to go get some dessert. I don't know you could get lip balm. Oh my God, they look like little tubs almost. Gonna go check out the shops. Got my cowrie necklace on. Just my little set. Sneakers. Oh, my bag. Oh my Just had tasty lunch, now heading back to Dog Shack to try one of their vegan cookies. I got a cup of oat milk to have with my cookie. And it's nice and the cookie's warmed. It's so good, I already tried some. Here she is. Top of the TV. Oh, that's actually quite good. Dinner outfit, crop t-shirt, Swarovski necklace, and these shorts. My friend custom made these for me. They're pink satin shorts. They're so cute. And this bag. Okay, let's go. Here is our dinner. We got grilled takeaway. I got the vegan cheeseburger. My brother got something truffle or other. We got some chips and we have some fancy water and wine glasses. And now we're gonna watch WandaVision on my laptop. <laughs> Time for a little dessert. What did I get? I got the vegan, vegan uh, coconut almond fudge. 